Thank you for joining us here on the news at six o'clock. I'm Stephen Quinn and I'm Muriel Bailey uh, in for Brenda. Now veterans in Coleman County are now getting increased access to an innovative PTSD treatment. Some medical experts are calling it a game changer for these men as well as women. The treatment helps relieve symptoms of anxiety to patients who use it as ABC 3340's Kyra Purvis reports. The new increase in access is already helping hundreds of veterans in Coleman. To be able to take a three-day trip and turn it into a three-hour trip is amazing. Brian Monk is a military veteran of 14 years. After years of suffering from PTSD, Monk began looking for treatment options to help the stellate ganglion block shot being seen as the most effective. It's helped reset my fear, anxiety, depression, uh, suicidal tendencies, suicidal thoughts. Uh, it has changed my life. The shot is administered to PTSD patients at the base of the neck. The injection serves as a long acting local anesthetic that blocks a patient's fight or flight response from traveling to the brain and in turn relieving some of those anxiety symptoms. For Monk, the closest facility to offer the treatment was in Maryland. It's hard for people to take off work. It's still hard to get some veterans in the vehicle to drive that distance. Now that has changed. A pilot program implemented by state legislature allocated $200,000 to provide 160 veterans with free access to the treatment. Coleman was originally not included as an administrating area, but local physician Dr. Jeremy Barlow has made that possible. 99% of the people that we've done have had some level of improvement. Our, our practice has expanded to the point where we felt like time was right for us to start doing that here. Dr. Barlow offers these shots to veterans in need every Friday at his Coleman office. Monk hoping the effort will lead to permanent access in his county. I can get the veteran the shot and now it resets him where he can go forward. And now he can do the therapy, he can do uh, he can enjoy his life again, enjoy his family again. In Coleman, I'm Kyra Purvis, ABC 3340 News. And once the $200,000 in funds for the pilot program runs out, results will be taken back to the legislature. The goal is to secure permanent state funding for the treatment.